Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hey Elsie, when I'm back again with an exciting video. It's going to be a really quick um, get ready video with me. It's going to be chatty get ready video. So I really hope you enjoy this video. And before I get started with the video, I'm going to do a really quick haul. I mean, uh, I just bought a few products. I've been buying it since last two weeks. So I really want you to see that. So let me just quickly put the clip. So guys, I'm going to quickly do a haul video. I really want to show you like what I bought. So I've been purchasing this stuff since last two weeks. So I'm going to quickly show you everything I have right here. It's going to be like a really quick haul. So let's begin. So let's begin with my eyelashes. Okay, I have this. Can you see these eyelashes? So yeah, I got this uh, packet. Uh, like these, these were like three pack of lashes. Can you see they're like so good quality i love it and it's from this brand i i don't remember the price of everything so i i'll have it on the screen i'll just check on my amazon and, and i'll have it on the screen so most of my products are from amazon but then i do purchase few stuff from nika so yeah okay these were lashes next i bought this beautiful um lip liner i don't remember from where i got it i think from amazon yeah so this is in the shade the swiss beauty 3 hazelnut so this is the shade hazelnut and this is how it looks like let me just quickly swatch it it is super soft can you see this is like really creamy very soft i love it i got this pack of three brushes very good quality brushes you guys can you see the middle one i used it this is like a lip brush i used it so much and this this brushes you know lip brushes only works if you are using like dark lipstick if if your lipstick is a bit sheer or nude it does not work that well i mean i don't know why and how but yeah this works with like colorful lipsticks i tried it on and this is the amazing product i love this lip brush and it's by the brand glories lip liner brush so this is a lip liner brush and i have another brush here it is eyeliner brush so i did not use it not even once i decided to use this for this video and i forgot <laughs> so the next one is like angled brush this is amazing brush to fill in your brows or maybe do like eyeliner tricks with it i mean i'll show you like in another video where i'll do like natural looking makeup and in that uh makeup look i'll show you how to use this one okay and the next is so this is very beautiful sugar pop brown eyeline eyeliner kajal it's so so soft you guys again it is like really it glides on super super smooth i love this color pop um eyeliner this is amazing quality you definitely have to purchase it i mean if you love eyeliners like colorful eyeliners the next i want to show you is Oh, forgot to show you this um, glue came with this product okay these were like as I told you three sets one is over here and these these are the two lashes if you want to see how I created this beautiful makeup look if you can see I'm not sure the lighting is really poor I'm sorry about it and yeah this is how it looks like so yeah and the next is okay the next is this beautiful eyelash, 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 eyelash palette. Wow, <laughs> this is eyeshadow palette, you guys. As you can see, the colors are like really bright and pretty. And this even it has like a button open up. Like you, there's a button over here. You click it and it opens up like this. So look at the colors. It looks so gorgeous. However, the quality is not that good. I mean, it's very chalky, pretty powdery but i shouldn't be complaining because it's pretty affordable product the price will be here somewhere so it's like so cheap so yeah let me just swatch all the colors this is like blue and this is yellow and this is like orange and green and pink and i'm gonna purple on the same hand and this is like purple can you see purple and pink the rest of the colors it's like i mean if you know india's pretty famous festival called holi 
you can actually use these colors for that festival i mean because this is like pretty chalky powdery palette um i mean if you want to like you know want to buy like eyeshadow you want colorful eyeshadows in like affordable range then you can go for this but in case if you have couple more hundred rupees then go for something good quality because i don't know i, I don't i don't know if i should say that because today i tried to do this uh try to use this palette and this is how my eyeshadow turned out to be but also i did a little bit of mistake i mean i used dark concealer instead of going with this type of concealer so that can be the reason why the color payoff is not that good but you know i recommend going for a bit good quality eyeshadows okay and the next is i bought like nail polish can you see this is pretty good nail polish the quality is really good i tried it sugar pop is a good brand actually i have it on my nails can you see them i love it and then i have this beautiful um eyeliner eyeliner <laughs> nail polish remover so you open this up and i cannot i and then you see there is a sponge right here you dip your finger in it and then twist your finger and your finger will be clean like super clean so yeah that's that and the next is i love it it's a beautiful product i love it it's so good quality it's so affordable it's only for 100 rupees you guys and this is highlighter by the way and it's let me just swatch it like oh my god this is like so so good if you can see i mean i'll show you how i use it in my video i mean in this video okay my legs are painting so this is like amazing product i love it but then i don't know how to use like um creamy products i'm not really good with creamy products but usually highlighters are in this creamy shade like you know solid creamy shade i would want to try out the liquid eye, eye highlighter i would want to see how it's gonna look on my face like you know yeah and the next is the foundations this is amazing foundation nika i love this nika foundation i love the color but then it is a little bit like orangish i have it on my face today can you see this this is the same foundation i mean i used not that bad you guys and the quality is also good and the price i'm not sure i'll let you guys know here and it's in the shade coffee 14 i think it's the darkest um yeah this is how it looks like it's beautiful i love it and the next one is this one this is uh 3 340 in the shade fit me it's by the brand fit me can i open yeah so this is how it looks like let me just try out on my hand i'll just show you the shade okay okay can you see this so this is like it's like my shade actually foundation brush so can you see this is it's like let me blend it a little more so it's a bit like orange can you see the orange it's like so orangish so all the dark foundations like end up with a lot of orange in them i don't know why but yeah after blending it this is how it looks like it's too orange pretty orangey foundation you guys i look i love the quality and all everything is like super nice i like it it's pretty light coverage it's like medium to light light to medium i mean so not heavy coverage but it's like really good quality i love fit me foundations actually they are very cheap as well so i got it only for like 380 rupees but this is how it looks i don't like this orangish shade i don't like it but then if i go with like one shade lighter or even lighter than this then i will end up looking gray so i would rather look orange than gray <laughs> okay that's the foundation and next we'll uh, move on to this powder this is by the brand nika it's in the shade chestnut 8 and this is the darkest shade they have this is like this is how it looks like uh, let me just quickly swatch it okay here and i'm gonna just put it right here like, let me just swatch if you can see can you see it I don't know if you can see what this is this swatch let's just do it here 
okay that's it so anyways this is how it looks like okay anyways well i am done with the foundation powder and i have oh <laughs> i forgot to talk about this concealer this is like color corrector i'll have the brand this shade and everything over here on the screen and this is how it looks like this is like jumbo concealer i love this is so big i love big concealers i don't know why let me do a little swatch i love it i love it. it's pretty orange obviously it's a color corrector not a concealer my bad it's it's a color corrector let me just use my um concealer brush let me just quickly try to blend it can you see the color payoff is so good it's like very pigmented it has so much product in it i love it can you see look at my foundation and my color corrector there's no much difference between my foundation and my color corrector i don't know why they do a lot of orange in dark shades okay this is how it looks like this is the color corrector okay that's that now let's move on to lipsticks i have four five six lipsticks in front of me let's just try all the lipsticks okay this one is the it is not even like a lipstick it's by this brand swiss beauty and in the shade hazelnut oh it's the same shade as my lip liner but then lip liner is pretty pigmented this one even if in like even if you swatch it 10 times you will still not see the pigment it is like so it, it's kind of like a lip gloss lip gloss in the body of lipstick if it makes sense okay let me hear this is my lightest portion okay this is how it looks like okay since it's pretty light you can actually see on the dark why can oh, wow is this the shade no miss okay well i okay let me shit uh, swatch it again this is the swatch so can you see this is not pigmented at all especially on my dark lips it's not pigmented enough i tried it in this video you will see that this is yeah but if you are someone who likes to look pretty natural who want to always rock nude lips then you can go with this you will be happy and especially if you have not so pigmented lips <laughs> only then go with this one and the next uh, neutral nude or lipstick is by the brand mars it's in the shade 22 mars so this is the bullet this is perfect match for my skin tone i love this nude it is so gorgeous i am in love okay let me just quickly swatch it where can i swatch here okay if you can see can you see i mean i don't know if you can see okay this is the swatch it is so good quality i love it and also i used this is the same lipstick on my lips oh my god why did i swatch it i would have showed you my lips <laughs> okay can you see i love it okay the next lipstick is this one and this lipstick okay this is also by the same brand mars it's in the, and it's in the shade gorgeous grape it's 12 and look at it it's beautiful beautiful purple it's like can you see it's like grape it's like velvetish color and but on my cheeks it looked pink yes you guys it looked pink i tried it on so yeah i love this shade it's beautiful let me quickly swatch it swatch it right here can you see this is, this looks again this looks pretty pink it's uh, it's violetish color no this looks exactly the same this is the this is how it looks like you guys i don't know if, it, if you can see so yeah this is like amazing lipstick this is the product i'm definitely going to repurchase definitely like i love this shade if you are just as black as me or just as dark as me then definitely you will love it i mean yeah if you're darker than me it will look so good on you trust me and then I have another lipstick. It's in the shade 
peaceful pink in the shade 10 usually how you open lipsticks like this like right all the lipsticks open like this but this no this does not open like that you have to twist it open like this like a screw so this is another beautiful shade i love it i mean you have to have a full face of makeup to look good with this lipstick because if you are like you know dark skin girl again you will have a lot of pigmentation everywhere this does not look good and also it will wash you off it does to me so yeah but if you have makeup on this will look good let me swatch it it is like Nicki Minaj pink I love the color I love the color like I am so happy to buy these lipsticks and they're even not that pricey okay the next and the last product is this one I also have one more product let me show you that I think I've already seen this in my previous video I've got this like a month ago from from like a street market um i don't normally purchase things from the streets when it comes to makeup but then i really like the color it's pretty nude it's too nude it's just for like fair skin tones let me just swatch it oh let me swatch it here can you see it just blended in my skin tone okay my battery is running low you guys let me quickly finish this Oh, and you see it just it looks like a concealer I mean yeah and the next product is oh this is oh my god I literally thought this is like this is a lip gloss this is eyelash oh no eyelash eyeshadow yeah this is like metallic eyeshadow in the sparkly metallic eyeshadow in the shade uh, 08 Big Bang. This is like Big Bang and it's beautiful shade. I used it once. I'm not sure if I have shown you this. I'm not sure but this is like amazing product. This is the brush applicator. I mean I am in love with this metallic eyeshadow. I want to buy more of this. So you can put it over any eyeshadow. Can you see this? Oh, it is so pigmented. But then if you like blend it it will lose all its pigment like really quickly like can you see that but then it still has that sparkly effect this is what i like i don't want too pigmented it's gonna look really weird so yeah i like it blended and it does not blend so much i mean you're not dragging it just blend it tap it like tap it tap it whatever so, yeah that's it i am tired that's about it you guys for this haul i hope i showed you all the products oh yeah that's about it yeah i hope you have watched those um products i bought and i'm gonna be using all those products in this video today i'm just so excited to use these products because i love trying out new makeup so let's get into the video okay before i start i'm gonna use my moisturizer I, this is what i use every single day dr russell onion cream right here so if you can see I'm gonna put this on my face I wanted to do like a video um, yesterday but then I was so tired and you know I went out and yeah the day wasn't that good also I'm gonna do like membership video today okay I'm done moisturizing my face now I'm gonna move to primer so if you want a good makeup you have to use primer I'm just so obsessed with primers I love it okay if you want like smooth uh, base go ahead with primer they are really really important and i'm so sorry i've been not posting like story time videos i have amazing story you guys i think i'll do it tomorrow yes i'm gonna post a story time video tomorrow i'm not sure but we'll try <laughs> okay i think i'm so far away should i come a little closer because i'm doing makeup video so okay I am done priming just put a little bit on my eyelids oh my face feels so soft I'm getting so obsessed day by day with makeup you guys I don't know I just feel like buying so many products it's just not about makeup I guess because I have this problem I don't know if what you call this I think shopaholic problem or like spendaholic I'm not sure what it is called but you know if I like something if I start still like something i just want that so much more uh you know if i like a top 
I won't be like happy buying just that top. I want similar top in all the colors. You know, I want similar top in different styles. I don't know what it is. Like, I don't know why am I like that. I think this is also with makeup. I don't know if I really like makeup or I'm just collecting the products. I don't know. But you know, to me what it feels like, I'm enjoying right now this moment. I'm enjoying it a lot and I want to do a lot of makeup videos. <laughs> I don't know maybe a thing I mean even if you like if you know me since the beginning then you can check out my channel you know if I'm into like fashion I'll make like hundreds of fashion videos like the entire month or two months or three months is gonna be like just fashion videos if I like vlog no matter how shitty video I post I will be posting vlog videos you know now I think I'm on the makeup thing and after a few months I'm just gonna stop posting makeup I guess I'm not sure I don't want to do this because I'm actually loving it so much I don't know my mind changes so quick okay uh, if i talk i just don't stop okay so i'm done with the primer as i already told you let's do color correction okay i got this new product you might have already seen orange a oh, zero five orange color corrector it's beautiful orange color corrector let's just quickly color correct oh my god i love makeup products I am obsessed with makeup. Oh my god, I am enjoying it. Oh, lovely. It feels so good to put makeup on. Like, I'm enjoying my life right now. Yes. By doing this makeup, by using this product. I love makeup. I'm so obsessed. Okay, let's use this concealer brush which I got from Amazon, I guess. No, no, I think I got it from nika yeah nika you you cannot find this uh brush on amazon it's pack 219 brush it's perfect concealer brush i mean it's perfect i mean it does not look perfect but then it is please believe me i was like on a hunt for concealer brush for so long and i finally found the best one so yeah uh <laughs> chocolate 601 is the shade of blue heaven concealer and I'm going to conceal it. This is like my shade. Can you see it is blending into my skin literally? Or maybe I can say blending into my con my color corrector. Whatever. Oh, I did not color correct right here. Okay, no problem. I'll just use this concealer. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Like if you're a brown girl or if you are a girl with like dark skin, then this right here what i'm doing is really crucial like you have to do this no matter what because otherwise you will end up looking gray and i don't like the look of gray i did used to look gray a lot of the times because i never had proper foundation which matched my skin okay my mirror is like so far away from me so i'm not like able to see Okay, I am just getting so mad at my hair. It's oil. Oh. This is my makeup headband. This is how I like my hair to be. Because, I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna use this lip balm because my lips are so chapped. Um, This is like super... Yeah, it tastes so good. It's a gift again. Fruit grapefruit burst 100% natural lip conditioner so my dad's friend bought this from Canada from me so thanks to her if if she ever watches this video and I don't want to I don't want her to watch this video because otherwise she'll tell to my dad that I make a videos and I don't want my dad to know that I make videos let's do let's do foundations so okay, here I have two foundations um, it, one is from Maybelline and the other one is from Nika. This is Nika All Day Matte Foundation here. And this is like Fit Me 340 shade. So this shade is definitely one or two shades darker to my skin tone. Have this in so many shades. Like I think I have three more different shades of this foundation, I guess. Maybe. Not really sure. But yeah, I have so many of these. So I know how this foundation, I know the quality and everything. So I'm not going to use this today in the video. I'm going to use this one. I have never used this before and it's definitely a bit orangish even that one is I don't know why these foundations are so orange I don't get that but anyways let's just try this on I don't like the applicator like this is this is how it looks like what is this I don't like this 
Well, anyways, let's just put it on my face. Okay. This is too much. But I like too much foundation. Alright. Now I'm gonna take my foundation brush. Like how beauty goodies use like brush on one side and sponge on the other. I don't want to use sponge because I don't like sponges. They, they absorb a lot of the foundations and I don't like that. <laughs> so I'm gonna use this brush. I wanna just pat it like that. Pat it like this, like, you know, all over your face first before you blend it. So, you know, the foundation reaches every corner of your face. Okay. So, I'm gonna put it like this here, here, here. Oh, oh my, I messed up. That's too much. That is too much. So, okay yes i'm right yeah can you see this is like so orange if you can see look at my ear and look at this but i'm loving the foundation it's not that bad oh <gasps> so much shit the product is also leaking from this side Okay, I'm gonna just do this. This is like perfect match for my forehead. <laughs> Let you match my forehead so nice. Okay, now it's time for concealer. The highlighting concealer, which is this one. Inside concealer. This is the concealer, this is how it looks like. Okay, I'm gonna do the classic triangle. If you can see, I don't know, my goodness. So I'm gonna highlight a lot of points on my face. <laughs> okay, I think this is it. So again, I'm gonna go ahead with my concealer brush. I love this brush. I love it. So let's just quickly blend. So, yeah. I'm gonna come up with more videos, you guys. I'm gonna do a lot of, lot more uh, get ready videos with me. Okay, I blended this shade. So I blended right here. Okay. And so when you leave your like concealer or foundation on your face for a couple of minutes then it's gonna absorb all the oil and all the solid will be left and it gets so hard to blend but you know if you're someone who wants high coverage then you can use this trick put a lot of foundation on and leave it for like a couple of minutes and then blend it you will see it will get that you know the, the foundation will turn into thick paste you, I hope you understand. So now my face looks a little better. It's time for baking. I'm gonna bake my under eye really good because you know if you don't then you'll end up with a lot of crease lines. Okay so I'm gonna use this rose powder by the brand Lacme. So I think it's I don't know it's pretty old powder actually. So I'm gonna use my blush brush to put this powder like that. Oh my god it got into my eye. Oh now let's do my eyes and then we'll come back to this right here for my eyes i'm gonna use this concealer again i'm gonna just simply conceal my eyes before i start with my eyeshadow so yeah i don't use any primer or anything i just use the concealer oh my god it's getting into my eye and this is good but then i don't know why is it feeling so sharp let's just use this beautiful palette here the, i love the way it opens like click in the middle and it's gonna open i mean oh, oh i was about to drop this <gasps> okay look at this what color should i go for let's just go for orange and yellow that's what i can think of right now 
I'm gonna do a lot of tutorials yes using this palette I love colorful eyeshadows so um, so if you are a beginner you're watching a wrong video to learn makeup just kidding <laughs> okay I'm gonna go with the lightest shade I'm gonna pick the yellow and if you can see I'll come close so usually people do their eyes first so they can avoid you know fallouts this is just a chalky super chalky eyeshadow you guys it's so chalky i think i should I, I should have used obviously i'm doing it wrong and i'm blaming on the product my dumb head so i think i should have used this concealer and then used these products over this concealer because you know if you have dark eyelids no color will show up on your eyelid so yeah so i'm back with this palette it's S sfr color eyeshadow palette so it also has a lot of shades in there i'm gonna use this brown bronzy um metallic bronzy color if you can see that one so i'm gonna use here like i'm gonna blend it here on top and yeah and it pretty much looks i messed up the same eyeshadow brush by vega so i'm gonna pick up the orange the color which is next to yellow oh my this product is so chalky you guys i don't know how i'm gonna work with this product and I picked up so much of it because it was chalky. I don't know what I'm doing, you guys. I'm literally messing up my eyeshadow look. Now let's pick up yellow again since my yellow vanished. I'm gonna tap it a little more here. Okay, I hope you can see the look. So now I'm liking it. It looks like a sunset on my eyelids take my blending brush blend this eyeshadow really well so here is the completed eyeshadow look now i'm gonna go with eyeliner okay so before i move on to eyeliner i'm gonna quickly clean the loose powder off my face oh it does not oh my god i think this powder stuck right here oh this is going to be a fail makeup tutorial and yeah now it looks so bright i don't know what to do okay uh i'm gonna go ahead with my pressed powder so here is the one oh okay <laughs> i'm gonna use this one it's by the brand nika and it's in the shade chestnut 08 this is the darkest shade it looks very lighter to my skin tone. i think it's like a shade darker to my skin tone that's how I think when I put it on my face. But on videos, I don't know why it looks so light. Okay, let's just use my blush brush. This is this is the brush which I've been using it for almost like 4 or 5 years. So I love this brush. And yeah, this is like a powder brush. I'm going to swirl my brush here. And put the face powder. Okay. And also my forehead gets so wrinkly. So yeah. I I know it's a bit weird. People start from the end and then, then they do the eyeliner and I start from the middle. I don't know, I feel comfortable like this. so you guys as you can see i messed up my eyeliner this looks a little thicker this looks thinner so i'm gonna go ahead and fix it i 
this mascara, which is by Maybelline, the Colossal. So, yeah. Okay, let's just go with the blusher. Now, let's just go with highlighter first. Okay, so here is the highlighter. This is very good quality highlighter, you guys. It's amazing. I used it already. <laughs> so this is how it looks like. Okay, this in the shade Cosmic Power 06. Is it 06? Yeah. It's really good highlighter and it's so, so affordable. It's just 400 rupees. Can you believe it? Just for 100. I, f I find it so difficult to blend highlighters. I don't know the trick to blend eye highlighters. I think you need to have like a smooth skin lighter thing. Look at this. It is like super pigmented and it's just like really good quality highlighter. It's just that I don't know how to put this on. To be very honest, I don't really like cream product foundation. I just don't want cream products. I also have like Blue Heavens cream blush, but then whenever I use it on my foundation, it just, you know, my foundation swipes away. That's why I don't like that. I'm gonna go ahead with blush. That's the reason I put on my highlighter first because, you know, if it looks a bit messed up, I can, you know, uh, always go ahead with blusher. I can just, you know, have blusher over it and it can just cover. I'm gonna use this blusher. I use this blusher a lot, a lot. It's by the brand Chameleon Professional Blusher. So I'm gonna swirl my brush over here on the product and I'm gonna get that on my cheekbones. Okay. This this blusher is actually like red in color. Over this highlighter, it looks pretty pink. Can you see? It's just changed the color. So I'm gonna go with my another cheek this right here I like this you know this anime kind of look I have like a brown eyeliner to do freckles like you know fake freckles here um, it's better I buy a freckle pen instead of you know experimenting with eyeliner or should I go ahead and do it Here I have a perfect brown eyeliner for freckles. Look at that. Let's just try it out. Anyways, this is going to be a fail video. <laughs> so put it like on my index finger, like a tiny dots. So here, can you see? Oh my, dab it all over here. <gasps> it looks cat's pow. So you guys this is how i look so far <laughs> it looks like baby kitten ran over my face okay let's just leave it like this you know so we make mistakes everyone make mistakes so we're just gonna ignore we'll ignore the freckles as if they're not here okay mm -hmm. it's time for eyebrows so for eyebrows i've got a beautiful eyebrow pencil brow pencil by blue heaven Okay, if you can see all of the shape, I have showed you a lot of times. Now I'm gonna just simply just brush it. Okay, that's it. Done with the eyebrows. That was quick, I know. My brown eyeliner, brown kajal. beautiful super soft matte brown pencil so i'm gonna go with my pencil like sugar pop pencil on the lower lash line okay so if you can see let's just show you <laughs> 
so I normally don't put like um, anything on my lower lash line apart from mascara because I don't know why I just don't do that but just the just just for the sake of the video I'm doing it because I wanted to show you like how this um, pencil looks like actually on eyes so yeah now it's time for fake lashes okay mm -hmm. here are my lashes and I think I should go with the dramatic ones it looks like glue is free with this eyelash so I'm gonna go ahead put a little bit of glue look at this eye which is girly which is cool which is fashionable which is pretty please let me know guys do I look pretty or I look pretty <laughs> now I'm gonna use my lipstick okay I have a lot of new lipsticks but I'm gonna I have these two new lipsticks I'm gonna try this one first okay here is my lip brush I am just obsessed with using lip brushes so I'm gonna use a lip brush to make it look like a lip liner oh I do have a lip liner okay no I should go with the lip okay wait I'll use lip liner and show you just a little bit of lip lining Can you see it actually works? Okay, that's what I want to show you. That's it. Now I'm gonna go with this lipstick. This is pretty like sheer uh, nude lipstick, so I'm gonna go right away. God, it is a lip gloss. I'm not gonna use this lipstick, it does not work. Okay, let's just go with another nude lipstick, which is this one by the brand Mars, and I used it a couple of times already. It's very good lipstick it's by the brand Mars and it's in shade 22 and I'm gonna definitely use the lip brush so okay let me show you so yeah that's it I'm not gonna use this lip brush it's like okay So this is called lipstick. I'm loving it. The lipstick and the shade is so good. It's fantabulous. But then the packaging is a bit off. I mean, it's pretty tight to twist. So you guys, can you see my look now? This is the completed makeup look. What do you think? Do I look pretty? Oh, I'm loving it. I am loving the look, you guys. Okay, let's just do my hair really quick. Okay. A subscriber had asked me to do like a um, headband headband hairstyle so I'm gonna good I'm gonna do that now okay this is how my makeup looks like with my hair okay now let's do the headband hairstyle really quick okay so I'm gonna pull some hair from this portion like this just this okay And I'm gonna simply braid it like normal blue strand braid and I'm gonna use this sparkly thread string whatever ahead and have this clipped right here oh, what the hell? I'm just gonna take this portion twist it I'm gonna just clip it back like that yeah it does not look that nice this side it looks totally different it looks like a different hairstyle and on this side it looks like a little cute i mean you can see the headband if you can so okay guys i'm loving it <laughs> so i can show you the dress i'm wearing so you guys i hope you can see the look 
I know this camera isn't doing justice you guys um, in real life the makeup is looking really good like trust me guys so guys this is like the outfit this like really cute outfit I love this dress and so this is how I make <laughs> oh I look pretty with the makeup was once a day that I would pray for you I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too Sneaking looks up and down from across the room and Damn, what a hell of a view I feel good, you look great I like you, I can't wait Our first time, our first day You're so fine, I'm so late You sip wine, I drink straight Don't waste time, to my place I feel my heart erase So catch me if I fall Keep them out in sight. 